Welcome to part two of rare and hard to find movies about relationships of older women and younger men. You probably haven't seen them, but you should. Let's start. Number 10, The Double Plus 15. The film tells the story of Anna and Eric, two people apparently with opposite lives who one day meet at a chat conversation. She is a mother of two children and has a good husband, but has an existential crisis in which she longs for the adventures of fun and youth. He is a teenager with a whole life ahead of him, with many unknowns. Both begin a relationship in which the questions that each one asks at their age are present. Aspirations, desires, goals, not knowing what to do or where to direct their lives. Number 9. The Forest Danila is 16, Katya is twice his age. He spends hours watching her out of the corner of his eye from an old shed on the edge of the forest. Meanwhile, his father lusts after Katya. Father and son are drawn into a turmoil of events where a neighbor turns against neighbor, dividing the community into us and them, pushing everyone's lives towards a disaster. Number 8. Zoology Natasha lives alone with her mother in a small seaside town. Her life is boring and conventional. In the zoo where she works, Natasha has long been an object of ridicule. Suddenly, a strange metamorphosis occurs to her. For no apparent reason, she grows a tail. She has to go through shame, hope, and despair to find herself. Number 7. Amor Bendito The son of a wealthy federal judge, Joan, is a naive young boy who falls in love easily. One day, he decides to flee alongside Luciana, a beautiful 35-year-old teacher at his school. They travel to a mansion in the inland part of the country to try and unleash their love. Soon, Joan discovers that he has fallen into a trap in which money, politics, violence, and a bit of love are mixed. Number 6. Verbotenes Verlangen. Ich liebe meinen Schüler. The neglected wife, Katerina, has an affair with her young student, Ben, who confesses his love to her. She sleeps with him a few times, pleasure and guilt balance each other. Despite the actually happy marriage of Katerina and Ulrich, tensions are inevitable. Katerina and Ben's life takes a dramatic turn when they fall in love and Katerina becomes pregnant. Number 5. Ein Hudleven. Widow Helen finds herself in financial trouble overnight. She moves into a building where she met Harry, an adorable and cute gay escort boy who also resides in that apartment. They bond a special friendship, but a one-night stand might ruin it all. Is there any chance Helen might be happy again? Number 4. Helena Year 1915. Helena Scherfbeck lives as a forgotten artist with her elderly mother in the countryside. It has been years since the last exhibit and Helena continues to paint only because of her passion. Everything changes by her encounter with amateur painter Einar Reuter, who is a passionate admirer of Helena's art. He becomes Helena's confidant and the unfulfilled love of her life. Inspired by true events, Helena describes the life of Finland's most acclaimed painter, Helena Scherfbeck between 1915 and 1923. Number 3. Clement A boy in his early teens develops a crush on a grown woman old enough to be his mother, only to discover she is also attracted to him. Marion is a hot-headed, free-spirited young woman, carefree and uncompromising. At her godson's birthday party, she meets Clement, a captivating, provocative teenager. They begin to play a game of seduction. Number 2. The Schoolboy and the Mailwoman The 17-year-old high school graduate Joe Reinhardt from a well-to-do family meets the fun-loving Rosemary while on vacation in Mallorca with his parents. He falls in love on the spot, but is too shy and the 37-year-old Rosemary initially reacts cautiously and finally gets involved with pubescent Joe. 
Joe eventually overcomes his shyness and wants to experience with her for the first time. Number 1. Sweet Rush In small-town Poland in the late 1950s, an aging woman married to a workaholic doctor meets a handsome, strapping 20-year-old man who makes her feel young again. She then beckons him into a mentor-protege relationship which inevitably leads to an affair. Framed around this story, lead actress Christina Janda discusses the death of her husband from cancer. Hey, I'm Maniacal Z. Thank you so much for watching this top 10. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so you know when we put out our new videos, which we are doing all the time. I'll see you guys on the next top 10.